Hello and welcome to the Thermoplastics versus Thermoset video series. In the first video, we're going to be covering what are they and the pros and cons. In this video, you will learn the difference between thermoplastics and thermosets, each of their properties, as well as the advantages and disadvantages of each of the plastic types. So let's have a look at what is a thermoset. Thermoset polymers are polymers that once molded are hardened, cannot be reshaped or recycled. A thermosetting plastic is a polymer that irreversibly becomes rigid when heated. Such a material is also known as a thermoset or thermosetting polymer. Initially, the polymer is a liquid or soft solid. Heat provides energy for chemical reactions that increase the cross-linking between polymer chains, curing the plastic. The rate of curing may be increasing in many cases by increasing pressure or by adding a catalyst. Many common plastics are thermosets, including vulcanized rubber, fiberglass, which is a fiber reinforced polymer composite, polyester resin, polyurethane, melamine, bakelite, and silicone resin, and epoxy resins. You can see here an example of bakelite knobs. So what is a thermoplastic? Thermoplastics are defined as polymers that can be melted and recast almost indefinitely. They are molten when heated and hardened upon cooling. Thermoplastic polymers are polymers that can be repeatedly heated and molded without affecting any change in their chemical or physical properties. When frozen, however, the thermoplastic becomes glass-like and subject to fracture. These characteristics, which lend the material its name, are reversible, so the material can be reheated, reshaped and frozen repeatedly. As a result, thermoplastics are mechanically recyclable. Some common thermoplastics include ABS, polypropylene, or PP, polyethylene, which is PE, high impact polystyrene, vinyl, nylon, and polycarbonate, and acrylic. You can see a typical biscuit tray here made of hips, which is high impact polystyrene. Let's have a look at the properties between thermoplastic and thermosets. I'm not going to read through all of these, I'll just pick out a few from both of these types. If we look under the thermoplastic, the first one here is the molecules have weak straight chain bonds between them that can be broken by heating. Conversely, the thermoset polymer, they have strong chemical bonds between molecules, including cross-linking, due to which they do not separate by heating. Another property comparison is a thermoplastic. They are elastic and flexible in nature, whereas a thermoset, they are hard and brittle. You can pause this slide to go through each of the comparisons in your own time. Let's have a look at some of the advantages for each of the types of polymer. So let's have a look down the thermoplastic polymers advantage list. It has high impact resistance, which is around 10 times more that of thermosets. Whereas the advantage of a thermoset is a high structural rigidity, giving it more strength. Thermoplastics also have high chemical resistance. And some of the advantages of thermosets is high durability and they have attractive finished product appearance. Again, you can pause this to have a look at each of these advantages in your own time. Let's have a look at some of the disadvantages of each of the polymer types. So the thermoplastic polymer, heat and pressure requirement for fiber reinforcement, whereas on the thermoset, Recycling is an inability. Thermoplastic polymers are pretty high cost, 
Another disadvantage of thermoplastic is leaching of hazardous chemicals in the long run. Another disadvantage on the thermo set side over here is good surface finish is tough to accomplish. Also, the emission during production process. Again, you can pause this to go through each of these comparisons in your own leisure. Don't forget to check out our other videos in this series and you can contact us if you need any help with your projects in China. And for more specialized information, visit our materials and process page in the Learning Center. My name is Paul Adams from Southeast, and I shall see you in the next video. Thank you.